Hi everyone, I'm Olivia and welcome to my channel Learning with Liv. So in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to use a compression bandage for a sprained or twisted ankle. I think it's important to know how to strap an ankle properly because if you consistently strap it incorrectly, you can possibly inflict further damage to the injury or it can have little to no effect on the healing process both of which can prolong the recovery time, especially if you're unintentionally doing more damage. Any first aid course will teach you to follow the RICE acronym as it's the most effective treatment method. And it stands for rest, ice, compression, and elevation. And today I'm going to show you the compression part. So today we're going to use a heavyweight crepe bandage in an adult size 10 centimeters by 2.3 meters with some cloth tape. So without further ado, let's get learning with Liv. So first of all, take the bandage out of the packet and remove the elasticized clip. You can choose whether to use this later or to just use the cloth tape, but for a child, I definitely wouldn't recommend it. Let's start out with the roll of bandage in your dominant hand with the stretched out part of the bandage at the bottom of the roll so it rolls out from underneath. This is important so that if you drop the roll, you can quickly catch it. Whereas if it's the opposite way and it's smooth on top, you're less likely to catch it. Having it the right way up also gives you better control for when you're bandaging. So place the bandage on top of the leg, just above the ankle bone and below the calf muscle, and we're going to anchor it here. This means we're going to wrap the bandage behind and around the leg two times, pulling it relatively tight and smoothening out the creases as you go, because they can become uncomfortable if they're compressed for too long, and so it gives an even compression. After the second wrap, we're going to bring the bandage down towards the toes on the side of your dominant hand, wrapping it underneath the ball of the foot and smoothening out the creases as you go. We're going to anchor it at the bottom by wrapping it horizontally at the toes. Once it's wrapped all the way around, we're going to now bring the bandage up towards the calf on the side of your dominant hand and wrap it around the back just below the calf and then again down towards the toes to make a figure of eight pattern smoothening the bandage as you go. Now we're going to continually follow this figure of eight pattern, but every time you bring the bandage back up towards the calf, move the bandage one centimeter over from the first line you wrapped to create this V-shaped point in the center of the foot. So now you can see we've created a braid-like pattern on the front of the foot. Remember to still pull it firmly as you go, but not too tight so you don't slow or cut the circulation of blood. Continue this figure of eight pattern until you get close to the end of the roll of bandage. And now what you'll do is wrap the end of the bandage up and around the back of the leg just below the calf and keep it in place using the clip or cloth tape. And there we have it, a properly strapped ankle using a compression bandage. So now we know the proper way to use a compression bandage for a sprained or twisted ankle. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to learn how to bandage any other parts of the body, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. See you next week.